Rockies in here this morning with a Lions club they never played yep. before, so we'll see how they do. Henry, I don't know if you've played. I don't know if you've been up here in the last year since we've had the game. You uh, may have. I've you probably have. Yes. You've seen it before. This is the way it works. Guys, I'm going to ask questions, current event questions. I've scanned all the newspapers I can get my hands on, Daily Mail, AL.com, anything else I want to make up. Roy is a veteran. <laughs> Playing, yes, he and D both. <laughs> this is the wrong yeah. answer. Zach is buzzer boy. Elton play. Bill Anderson. I got to tell you, no electronic devices can be used, such as cell phone. Brandon, y'all pay attention <laughs> over there, Barry. This is the right answer. The winners win a can of vinyl sausages. The reason we give these away every day, simply because that's what New Hope used to be called, my hometown. Pulled the Yankees burned it down. Then we renamed it. Here's the way we go. Here's the first question. What's happening in Athens today at two o'clock? Today. Just how we're managing that, Brandon. Yeah. The, the judge um, Horton. on the square. Honor. Judge Horton, that is a correct answer. Yeah. And the, the next, uh, but here's a real question. How many years ago was it when he ruled on that uh, case for that 83, one? 83 years. 83 years is the right Thank answer, Brad. Right? <laughs> Brad, uh, quit cheating. <laughs> I cheated. <laughs> I just looked right there and said, like, what'd you say? AL.com, <laughs> if 50 states in America were each independent countries, Alabama's rate of incarceration would be what with people in prison? Fifth or third? Fifth is the right answer. We got that many people locked up. This happened over the weekend. I know you just sold a car, a Mustang, that we'll talk about the limit, that you've had for 40 years. Really? 65 Mustang to a guy in Owens Crossroads. I hope it wasn't this dude. A guy from Owens Crossroads was arrested over the weekend for what? <laughs> Stealing a Mustang. Huh? In, oh, in Marshall County at a bathhouse. Oh, wow. Oh, oh he cell had phone. set up watching. Wait, That's the right, right answer. He had a cell phone set yeah, up taking sure pictures did. of a mother and her two daughters. Yeah, oh, but here's on, one. There he is right there. That's not the guy, is it, Bill? You sold us thank you. But anyway, here's what one of the comments was on AL.com, which, by the way, the best thing to read. It said, if the man had only dressed up like a woman, he could have walked right in, took all, taken all the pictures he wanted. Yeah. That's strange. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. Lane so Kiffin, Roy yes. used to be the coach yeah. of Tennessee, mm -hmm. and abandoned y'all and went to USC and got Sorry. fired. Yeah. Tennessee looking good this year, going to be in the top ten. Yeah. Got to play Bama up there. Last year, how much did the Southern Cal Trojans have to pay him? 3.4. Yeah. Well, 3. last year, what did they have to pay him? 3.4 million. Yeah. Wrong, know it all. Yes, it was. 2.7 million is the right answer. Uh -huh. So Alabama made up the 700 That's right. But here's the real question. Last year, because Alabama, how many touchdowns did Alabama score last year? Oh, wow. A bunch. 75. 55. <laughs> 65. Did not miss a single extra point. Scored 454 points. <laughs> we did miss a few field goals. But right, a quick, right quick, here's the real question. What does that work out to for Kiffman last year per point? Come on, Jay. $1,497.80 per point. I wish I could make that count. Huh? Huh? call plays like him. What does the uh, Decatur Daily's got a big thing this morning on uh, farm grown products and stuff. 1818 Farm down in Morris. You know, Morrisville got ranked ahead of Athens in places, best places to live. What does the term fresh to farm mean? Fresh from the farm? Fresh to farm. Straight. Fresh straight from, straight the straight from the farm. Straight from the garden. Straight from the market. Yeah. Right to the market. Yeah. And then eat it right there. there. It means right here. It says it people delicious. want to get back to their childhood. <laughs> Eating here makes them remember when they pick tomatoes for their grandmother or shuck corn. Yeah. All I remember about this time of year is having to pick beans. It was not a pleasurable experience. Mm. When it's this hot, you got to pick beans. you got a crop going now, don't you? Huge yeah. crop. Huge. I'm going to feed the community. <laughs> there ain't nobody out there, Roy. That's why I'm going to feed the <laughs> For the first time, millenniums have, that's 18 to 34-year-olds looking around this room. Nobody in here but Abby may be for that and Maddie. Now number 75.4 million says here, how many of those people are likely to are Bernie Sanders supporter? What percent? 
Twelve percent. Sixty percent. Five. Forty-five. Sixty-five percent is the right answer over there. Oh, they love them some Barney. Oh, yeah, because they have, don't have to do anything. All right. Representative Stephen Lynch, a Democrat from Massachusetts, recently disclosed that a congressional investigation found how many employees of the Department of Homeland Security listed on the U.S. terrorist, terrorist watch list. <laughs> don't, this, this is going to be scary. Ten? Right? ten? Y'all keep up with national news? Fifty. Way, the way this game works is you... Fifty. Seventy-two. That's scary right Can there. you believe that? How is that possible? That's, uh, that's bureaucracy in action. Uh -huh. Front page today, USA Today, cash crisis rocks Trump campaign. Yep. Yeah. Well, if there's any bad publicity out there, they're going to give it to Donald Trump. I can tell you that. The next president of the United States. Right. All right, here's the real question. He only got... How much money did Hillary Clinton bring in in May for her campaign? 43 million. Oh. I'll let you have it. 28 million, but then they added some more stuff. But here's the real question, Roy. <clears throat> How many people work full-time for the Trump payroll? He's had kind of a low, it's like 110 or something. It's much lower than Hillary's. 75. 69. How many does Hillary Clinton have? Over 800. Over 300, wasn't it? I'll let Henry have it. 685. Dang, that's a lot. That's what you do Yesterday you in California, in Needles, California, at, at 7 a.m., what was the temperature? 105. 105. 105. 105 is the right answer, Roy. This man's on it. He can't. He ain't too brand new. He's on it. Let's see if you know this one. Know it all. USA Today this morning. Right now, how many Instagram now reaches? How many people each month? Instagram. Oh my God. Four billion. <laughs> Close. Seven. How many pictures? Billion. That's the next question. Billion? Oh, okay. uh -huh. 500 million. <clears throat> Eighty percent of those people are from out of the United States. Really? Wow. How many photos and videos are shared each day on Instagram? Two million. Oh, no. Wow. It's, it's got to be six or seven hundred million. Ninety-five million photos. Yeah. All right, that was the easy questions. Good. Now, Bill, the way this works, I ask questions. Best of your knowledge, you try to answer them, okay? <laughs> Alabama's poorest town, according to AL.com, is what? And you folks playing at home, too. Mountain, is that what you said? New Hope. A New Hope. Hope. It's in Mobile. It's in Mobile South County. County. Pritchard. 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 Pritchard is. Yeah. What is the poverty rate in Pritchard? Yeah. 70, 70, yeah. 38 percent, actually. That's still bad. A good Samaritan rescued a family in a rollover van in California. Pulled them out of the van and everything. Paramedics pulled up. He took a glass, took a bottled water from them, and they took his pulse. And then he received a bill for that. How much was it? Oh wow. Six hundred dollars. Fifteen hundred. Twelve hundred. One hundred forty-three dollars. It was real cheap, but they still billed him wow. for the bottled water. Yeah, for that. Are you kidding? It's an expensive. Water. What is the most dangerous city on earth? Rio. That's close. Birmingham. Birmingham? No, that's close. close. New York City. No, not New York City. Chicago. Chicago Caracas. 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 Right, and they have three and a half million people. Three thousand nine hundred and forty-six murders last year. Good. Well, socialism works out so well. What is the number one business in this town? Prostitution. Selling knives? Drugs. 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 Yeah, probably drugs. Prostitution. We say drugs. Kidnapping. Kidnapping. Yeah. Right. That's probably got something to do with drugs. <laughs> 92 to 97 percent of all suspects are released because of the corruption over there. Wow. Wow. Don't go there. It's unreal. All right, here's one. What state in the United States did this? A congressman there introduced a bill that would require rich people who claim over $150,000 in deductions to be drug tested. <laughs> That's got to be Massachusetts. Wisconsin. They are, he is a strong, what'd you say? Wisconsin. That is the correct answer, yeah, Wisconsin. Really. Wow. They are a strong advocate for special, pro, for social programs. <laughs> they are strong. I, I just wonder what the reasoning is. 
There's a new book. Don't be asking me a bunch of questions. I'm trying to work. <laughs> There's a new book out by a former Secret Service agent on Hillary Clinton. Yeah. Y'all heard yeah. about it? It just yeah. came out. Yeah. Why? Where is it banned from interviews? All the, all the big networks. All the networks have banned it. Are you kidding me? Because the Hillary Clinton campaign has asked them to do that. Yeah. Really? Where's the only place you'll see him in a live interview? Uh, Sean Hannity. Sean guys, Hannity is, is right. Mine. Zach, yeah. words of wisdom, and i got two other questions. Anyone can lend crazy. advice but a real friend. Let me try this again. <laughs> Anyone can lend advice but a real friend will lend a helping hand. That's good, Zach. That's true. Thank you, Zach. You're welcome. Sure. Yes. There are good ships Definitely and good ships, ships yeah. both that sail the sea, <laughs> but the best ships are friendships, and may they always be. Woohoo! I like it. Bill oh, Anderson, the prophet in here this morning. I need morning. to remember that one. He that. showed me up. That's better than mine. <laughs> what happened at the IHOP in Memphis? They had a fight. brawl. A big fight. Sisters. I mean, a brawl. <laughs> Who was it fighting? Sisters. A lot of Two sisters. sisters. That's a great yeah. character. Yeah. One of them. Oh, wow. One of them hey, worked there. Still had her uniform on now. The other, they did thousand dollars worth of damage, throwing oh, furniture. One of them pulled an knife on the other one. <laughs> the other one needs to learn how to punch because she's punching like this. She's going to break a knuckle. Zach, you, go you are ineligible on this next question. Oh come on. Uh -oh. Because we discussed it yesterday. Okay. I don't know how many of y'all watched the U.S. Open over the weekend. Yes. Dustin Johnson, I yep. loved it. I watched every bit of it Sunday afternoon. I don't play golf, never have, but love to watch it. The big four. Dust, there's a controversy now. Yeah. What is it? <laughs> no, that, not, that's technical. Too technical. Not about the moving the ball. They have said he did move it. What's the other controversy? Zach is in Elbow. I know what the The white dress. The, oh, the white dress. Who his wife is? His wife, is. Uh, his wife is Wayne Gretzky's daughter. Yeah, I know, but what's the controversy? The Her outfit dress? she was Pretty wearing short. in the camera. Did you see it? I did. Gosh. Who did? <laughs> I'm you. The controversy is, is when he won, he's going up there. Right, that shot right yeah, there. Right that's there. the controversy. They're saying Ooh. the cameraman is taking a lot of heat for that. Wow. 